another episode of Sunny Side Up right here on Kosher.com. And I've got with me the one and only Nikki Weinstock. How are you? I'm oh, good. I'm excited to be here. I'm so excited to have you on. What are we making today? Okay, today we're making a crispy potato salad because I feel like potato salad, it's a staple for the summer, but it's very overdone. We've been doing it for a while. We need to mix it up a little bit. So this time we're going to crisp our potatoes and just Ooh. add something to the classic. So stay tuned. Start something new with potato salad. This might be a new viral trend. I hope so. All right, let's make that happen. What okay, are we doing it is first? super easy. The first thing that we're gonna do is to dress the potatoes. Okay. So we have the potatoes in a bowl here. I like to use the colorful ones because it's prettier. Yeah, pretty. <laughs> and we're gonna just dress that with some olive oil. The whole thing? Yes, the whole thing okay. in there. Yeah. So olive oil, we have some salt, pepper. Use as much pepper as you like. Some rosemary. And of course, the best, the frozen garlic. Oh, yes. garlic is the best. Who chops garlic anymore? No way. Never, never. But you're not allowed to use jars of garlic. No. That yes. Breaks that it down, down, loses its flavor. I like these frozen ones, you pop them right out, tastes mm -hmm. fresh. So, Nikki, what got you into cooking? So, my dad was a huge, my dad loves to cook. And my mom was a single mom growing up, so she just, you know, she was really busy. So I'm like, how can I help out around the house? And I picked up the cooking for my dad, cooked every single night dinner for me, my brother, and I've just been obsessed with it ever since. Okay, that's yeah. great. What's your favorite thing to cook? Mm, anything easy. I love to cook easy. I'm a lazy cook. You can still cook lazy and make delicious food. You I like that. It doesn't have to be hard. And you've become a recipe developer and on your social media platforms, you've come up with some really exciting things to show us all, especially today. So once that's thoroughly mixed, yeah. that looks good. We can just pop that onto the baking tray. Shout out to the parchment paper. And Always give that a shout out. Every show I use it, I give it a shout out. <laughs> just much easier clean up and the food doesn't stick. Yes. Okay. And now I, we're going to throw that into the oven to I, get crispy. I, so what I do is just a okay. little trick. Yeah. So I, I spread out the potatoes or whatever vegetables I'm roasting so it browns all around. Because if it's touching, it'll steam and not crisp. Yes. I just want to give it a little bit of room there to. And we want these to be crispy. Okay, in the oven. Into the oven. They All go. right, let's go. Okay, what's up next? Okay, now we're just going to make the dressing. Okay. So. Can this dressing be used for different kinds of salads? I think this dressing can be used for anything. It's super versatile, but it does include pickle juice, so that's what gives it a little bit more of the, you know, little tang. I have a potato salad in my Pesach cookbook that has pickles in it. Really? I love that. Yeah, it's the best. Okay. Okay, so we've got mustard. This is some maple syrup. I like to add a little bit of sweetness. Mm, maple and mustard is fabulous mm -hmm. together. And then we have the pickle juice. Give that a whisk. Okay. Lemon juice. Lemon juice. I love fresh lemon juice. Okay. We've got some dill. Got all the right things that go into potato salad. Exactly. Mayo okay. again. Okay. New product. Mayo. Garlic mayo. I love mayo to begin with. So also just to add a little bit of that extra garlic flavor. Cream and creaminess. Yes. I would Good. do a little bit more. It's about it's a third a potato of a cup. salad, you know. We say it's a third a cup. Plus. That's a little but bit it's, more. It's a third of the cup, and the, you know, to Pass make us up. feel good. <laughs> I like using a little whisk because it kind of helps incorporate everything. It and really does. Especially when you add mustard, it's emulsifier, so it really helps everything mix really well and not separate. Okay, I'm gonna little pinky. That's great. Oh, Nikki, that's good. <laughs> mm. Okay, that's perfect. All right, so we're almost ready. Yeah. All right, what's next? Now oh, look what I've got. Oh, these look fabulous. Nikki, these look amazing. My family loves potatoes. I, everything potatoes is good. Yeah, I'm, I'm with you. It's Absolutely my favorite veg. So now we're just gonna throw this into the bowl. I got this really nice blue bowl here. It's stunning. Okay, we're gonna throw those potatoes in. This is what I love about parchment paper. You're free to add whatever 
add-ins you like, but it's a classic potato salad. We add our sour pickles and some chopped red onion. And that's all I like to add in potato salad. Anything else is a little too fancy. Then we're just gonna dress it. Giving another whirl as we go. This Perfect. is such a cute idea to do this as a roasted potato salad. I think it just elevates it. You could even do like crispy beef fry oh. or pastrami in I here. Would take it to the next level. That, or if you're doing a dairy feta cheese. Feta cheese, yes. Oh, this would be really good with feta cheese. Mm. No, I think it's best if you let it sit overnight in the refrigerator. Oh, okay. Just because, you know, the flavor, it gets into the potatoes a little bit more. So interesting. I never would have thought to cook the potatoes. It's also why it's perfect for Shabbos, because then, you know. Shabbos day. Do it. Yeah, exactly. Could you do this with leftover roasted potatoes? That is the perfect idea. Because sometimes I make a ton of potatoes, and it usually all goes, sometimes it even goes before Shabbos has started. <laughs> Um, but sometimes I make too many and they have a little bit left over, so I could make... I've never had leftover potatoes, but I'm sure, you Because I get carried away, you know, you yeah. think, you know... I know, I always think I need more potatoes than I do. Alright, let's go, let's see, let's dive right in there. I'll grab this one, you grab that one. Yeah, that one looks good. <laughs> okay. Let's have on. This is amazing! Next level. Perfect. This is really, really genius recipe. I love it. I'm so glad I finally got you on the show so we can just learn about this. This is great. It's perfect for the summer. Next level, Nikki. Next level. This is amazing. Thank you so much for coming on the show today. I'm glad we finally had you. Where can people find you? Find me on Instagram at Nikki Weinstock. And we can look out for more exciting recipes coming your way from Nikki and also on kosher.com. Check this out. Ready? We're starting? You know, oh, I gotta like. I shouldn't like it. All, right. all of your mustard. All, all the mustard. <laughs> oh, sorry. Okay. I didn't know. Okay, no, I don't know. No, sometimes it just flows.